Hello and welcome or welcome back to our home. It's Charlotte, your friend. Our boy is already turning one. So we're just coming to, to do a photo shoot here. I need you guys to come and experience this with me. And we'll see how it goes. He's one and he's been so grumpy this morning. I don't know if we're gonna pull it through, but hey, let's just go inside and check how it goes. Please hit the subscribe button and yeah see you inside come over come let's go
the photo shoot guys ah uh, uh, that was a mission you saw how it went i don't even have to explain myself it was not easy Mugai was not cooperating at all at all at all at all because wow so i came back and i just decided to take a shower refresh because it's quite hot today and before i can close off this uh, spend a day with me i need to share some pros and cons right since it's the beginning of the year we're starting things afresh you know we have goals you you know what i mean we got plans weight loss weight gains some people want to do improvements in, like kuningia so i have to share this so that maybe one of you might have a certain expectation in terms of weight loss so what i want to share is the pros and cons of weight loss right i have always been okay don't mind my hair we all know it's january and i i didn't i i, I <laughs> and my nails too <laughs> ha hi shim but at least i know what i did look at the 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 the, the, the wall so at least i bought paint so don't come for me i bought paint yes <laughs> So go down, baby. Okay. Um. There's weight loss, right? All my life, I've always been big. Like it's not new to me to have this body. Like, though people will make me maybe around what well, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, they would look at me and like, oh, girl, you you are so big. What happened? and to be honest i've always been big I, when i was growing up and i did try to lose weight i remember i used to run at the soccer field with the boys who used to play soccer after school i would make rounds with them when they they start with their warm-ups right and i remember at some point my mother once bought me hairbags the time it was trending yeah and nothing seemed to have worked so in 2020 2021 2020 2020 i then started my weight loss journey and i started by using herbalife products my sister-in-law was was uh, selling herbalife and she introduced me to their eating plan I followed strictly that diet and I was also having the shakes and voila, my girl lost weight, right? Then it happened that I I got um, stuck at a certain weight and I needed fast progress. Then I started benting then. When I was benting, uh, I did lose continuously some weight. So I personally didn't start losing weight through benting i was gymming doing happy life and the eating plan really helped me so pretty well 2021 december it was our wedding so 2021 throughout i was so motivated to even do better i was eating clean strictly healthy you understand and i did lose weight i don't want to lie i moved from size i think 44 my break even point was 44 and then I lost until I became size 36. But here's the thing. A weight loss did not come with more benefits than, I don't know, how do I put this? I'm sorry, guys. I realized that you all couldn't see me. It was a little bit blurry. So weight loss did not meet my expectation of weight loss people would always talk about weight loss as a journey of new person this lovely thing that can ever possibly happen to humankind but as much as i had lost weight from size 44 to size 36 i was not happy and my health was also challenged in a way truth be told when you fat it's easy for you to survive in a case of you get shot and the bullet can simply stuck inside your fats like 
you you continue with life <laughs> i'm kidding okay but what happened to me is that i did gain my energy number one number two there were clothes that would now sit well on me they would be they would look better on me than they used to before i lost weight the numbers on the scale i can't say like i was amused girl and but i did not feel thin that's the thing so pretty her head it's the soul that needs a surgery i felt that that's what i experienced from weight loss that you will in your mind you will always be fat you'll always be this big girl even when you get to shops and you start shopping there's a mos mosquito Moscon. didn't catch it sorry even when you get to the shop because you don't realize that you are now thinned you will always think of yourself as this big person in the shop you always try to get clothes for bubbly you don't even know where to start dressing yourself for a new body okay now let's come to the health implications that come with weight loss first of all i became so so vulnerable to disease a mere cold will just kick me um that i used to be the type that would get sick maybe per annum flu for me ugh, everybody around me would get flu then my husband we sleep on the same bed like oh but i would still not get sick my immune was perfect like in my fatness my fattest i was good and um that was the first thing i would now simply get ill and then number two i would fill my ribs when i sleep so i've never experienced filling the ribs like bro i've always had my meat now when i'm sleeping all of a sudden i need extra comforts i'm putting towels there there you go there's nothing to throw there okay so i'm sorry <laughs> you get tired of me so my ribs would need extra comfort when i sleep okay I would give it credit that now my husband would be able to wrap his whole arm around me and that's extra comfort right but i would need something to sleep on because my ribs were super super visible which i didn't like another thing that i didn't like about my got it oh another thing that i didn't like is that it affected my sexual life weight loss affected my sexual life and I, i'm not gonna lie about this when you are fed you are comfortable you know how certain things are done okay no i won't catch it anymore i'm not even gonna try i'm so sorry wot i hope you get it was not as easy as it used to be i finally killed it so having sex there's a certain position that you are comfortable at so now when i was thinner there were comf positions that I, I didn't like anymore they just didn't feel the same way and when you oh, guys i don't want to put a level of not younger than 18 but yeah you you get it let me just in a nutshell weight loss affected my sexual life thank you for watching let's meet again bye